Hey Bektos Globally, this is your page, the unbeatable soccer team star. In this video, I want to show you how I turn 1k to 39k on Bet Ninja Factual Football, making use of FIFA Mentor 2024 latest update. We have England copy and we have Germany copy. So right now guys, introducing Sharpest strategy, which is one of the best strategy inside VFL Mentor 7. And Sharpest strategy is peer-to-peer -peer analysis reading of anything that are ready to deliver accurate results after breaking down of formula. And we have three formulas inside Sharpest strategy, trial formula, edge formula, and period formula. So right now, making use of the period formula signal, because period formula is analysis is reading on the long run after four to five matches in order to select the accurate result so right now guys as you can see this is edge formula of liverpool versus wolf and chelsea versus leicester so both of them play home to win and we made little profit on that one so right now let's quickly go back to the previous ticket so this is another game so a way to score three goals so right now in order to win massively like this reading the period formula signal all you have to do is to target on activators so right here let me show you another one so this is another edge formula this is 13.4 and 2.54 so it will be six places so 13.4 2.54 times six times 450 because the stake is 450 then divide by 6 will give us 1680 so right here looking up to this game we have shatanti versus totiam we have western versus east which those are the two teams so right now looking up to algorithm sparing for the activators and predator totiam is a predator shatanti is an activator right here west Ham is a predator East switch is an activator so it is the combination of one predictor and one activator so looking up to the team's three test category strong test category balance test category and weak test category so totem is in strong test category while shatante is in weak test category west Ham is in balance test category while East switch is in weak test category so using the sf101 equation one and two we already know that under the algorithm sparing, Tottenham has the agility of 1 to 4 goals, while Shatanti has the agility of 1 to 2 goals. But Tottenham is not in form, which means Tottenham has lost 2 matches back to back, while Shatanti scored 2 goals in previous match. Under smart vectors techniques, anything that scored 2 goals in previous match has the upper hand. To score two or more goals in next match, which means their algorithm sparing will turn to one to four goals. That's the reason why I play a way to score. And using the period formula signal, Shatantin has played under up to five times. And once any activator play under back to back up to five times, that particular activator will deliver two three or more go and as you all know that shatanti already passed the smart vectors techniques because they scored two goals in previous match and they passed the period formula analysis because they have played under five times back to back and if you go back to the sf equation one total is in strong things while shatanti is in weak teams we have four and two so right now four and two for the equation one so right now let's go back to the smart vectors techniques shatanti scored two in previous match while tortia also played two one in previous match which means both of them scored two goals in previous match using the equation two that's one which means Tottenham has two goals, Shatantin has two goals, and we already have four two and we have two two. So, right now, looking up to the four and two, so we are going to use cross multiplication right now four two over two and two. So, right now, it will be two over two and four over two, which means any one of them has the agility of one to four goal right now to complete the equation one and equation two for the sf formula 101 so which means either tottenham or shatante 
can score from two to four goals. That's the reason why I play a way to score three and a way to score four for Shatan team. The way to score three is 23.6, while the way to score four is 158, and the game won successfully. That's exactly how to do it the right way. In order to select the accurate result, all you have to do is to introduce match vectors techniques, any team that scored two goals in previous match, and you also need to introduce period formula analysis, any team that play under four to five times back to back and make sure that particular team is an activator because we have two go market predators and activator under and over so under go market is for predator where over go market is for activator and whenever you want to select any analysis make sure it is one activator and one predator or both of them are activator don't go for two predator even if you want to introduce board mass using the plus and minus sign you can see that if two activator meeting each other they are going to produce activator because it is plus times plus is going to give us plus so it is 100 percent sure that you are going to do what you are going to win massively once you introduce the equation one and equation two and that's exactly how to do it the right way now let's look up to this edge formula again we can see that we have Brighton versus Leicester, Tottenham versus Shatanti in this future. The away to win is 13.4 and Shatanti is 15.1. The reason why I select this game is that I already know that Shatanti is not in winning form. White Tottenham is not in winning form. Brentford, Brighton, this is Brighton. Brighton is not in winning form. Leicester is not in winning form. As well, and Brighton is in balancing where Leicester is in weak teams, Tottenham is in strong teams, while Shatanton is in weak team. Both of them are not in winning form, which means their RNG algorithms will be balanced using the formation eight aces. The first eight is for speed, the second eight is for balance, while the last six is for reverse. So, under the reversing process, which is the laxes, which means Tottenham form is not stable, while Shatanton form is not stable. Brighton form is not stable, while Leicester form is not stable, which means any one of them can win or lose. That's the reason why you need to make use of incomplete edge formula right now. It will be home plus 2.5, draw plus 2.5, away plus 2.5. Then you introduce away plus under 2.5. That is the reason why I make use of away plus under 2.5 and that's 15.1. So 13.4 times 15.1 times 800 divided by 6. Okay, no, divide by 8. It will be divided by 8 because it will be 8 selection. So 13.4, 15.1 Times 800 divided by 8 will give us 10,115 naira. So that is massive winning, guys. As you can see, that's exactly how to do it the right way. So, all you need right now in order to learn more on this formula is to get yourself a copy of VFL Mentor 7 or Sharpest Formula 101. So, you can win massively like this. As you can see, these are massive winning on your screen, guys. So, let me show you another one. This is 283k. So, starting with 20k capital and that's 263k winning. So, it is a what? It is a banger. So, once you get yourself a copy of VFM Mentor 7 and Sharpest Formula 101, you will learn more and those formula are very simple to understand. So, everyone can make use of those formula and win massively on bet ninja virtual football we also have sporty bet copy we have bet power we have audi bet in kenya we have bet way in south africa no matter the country you are in africa you will get yourself a copy of the bookies you are making use and you are going to win massively so guys make sure you subscribe thanks for watching